Health is our fourth target of our eight-point stimulus program. My administration intends to hire another 5,000 healthcare workers with diploma or certificate level qualification for a period of one year. This will not only enhance our COVID-19 response capability, but also enhance the implementation of the Universal Health Care Coverage Program. Further, the stimulus program will set aside a further 1.7 billion shillings for the expansion of bed capacity in our public hospitals. And here, I encourage our Ministry of Health to utilize our Juakali sector in this endeavor. Let us make and build these beds that we shall supply here locally so that that money circulates in and amongst our people. Similarly, resources will be pumped into our medical research facilities to enhance their research capacity, which is critical to generate new innovations in the medical field, new innovations that will not only help us combat COVID-19, but also other diseases and afflictions that may face our people now and into the future. But with the extra resources, these facilities will also undergo some level of reform to optimize their performance. So fellow Kenyans, you will be hearing of changes in the sector of research to ensure that those who are going to be charged with that responsibility and with the resources being given are up to the task of meeting the desire and objectives, not just of government, but of the people of Kenya. I am persuaded that these reforms will upscale our medical research facilities to a standard that can indeed rival any in the rest of the world.